morning. Today is Friday, June 17th, 2022, and it is day number 160 in my fasting journey. Yesterday, I weighed in at 153.2 pounds, and this morning, I am at 153.8 pounds. I gained six tenths of a pound after having a refeed yesterday, but that's okay because rolling 72s will take care of that gain within the next day or two. Right now, I am in round 35 of rolling 72s, and I am about 21 hours in. And so I don't think that this round of rolling 72s will get me out of the 150s, but I think round 36 will definitely get me out of the 150s, and that's probably going to happen sometime next week. So I'm pretty excited about that. I am definitely looking forward to that milestone. And then after I leave the 150s, my next milestone is 149, which puts me at the 70 pound total weight loss mark. So I'm getting really excited and cannot wait to um, get to one to the 140s. And so hopefully sometime next week. Well, anyways, just kind of like as a reminder, what I had for my refeed yesterday was two tuna fish sandwiches, which I ordered from Panera, and I scraped the tuna off the sandwich and ate the tuna, but got rid of the bread. And I had to season the tuna with a little bit of salt and pepper, and that was around 360 calories. I also had coconut chunks, which was 400 calories. And something that I kind of forget is that the sandwiches, um, they come with lettuce, tomatoes, and onions. And I pulled those to the side and put extra virgin olive oil on them, which was 120 calories and made a salad out of them. And um, the sandwiches also come with um, pickles. It's just a very tiny sliver. And so I don't even know like what the calorie information for the pickles is. I'm going to estimate that it was probably eight calories of pickles. So um, in total, I had around 888 calories for my refeed yesterday. And probably the highlight of yesterday's meal for me was the pickles. I love pickles just like so much. And so um, I've just really enjoyed having those yesterday. And probably I, next time I go to the store, I should buy like some pickles. So that way I can have, start having pickles with my refeed. But anyways, um, so in the month of June, I have committed myself to walking 15,000 steps a day and also doing beginner calinetics. And beginner calinetics is a gentle like toning program that consists of 16 moves. And um, the results that I've been, you know, reading about online have been like astounding. People have just really sung the praises of calinetics. So it's definitely a um, workout that I am excited about and cannot wait to see like what the results are for my body. And so um, anyways, I kind of like had a nice streak going with uh, my calinetics and getting my steps in. And unfortunately, I broke my streak yesterday. And the reason is because I found out that my nephews, that the air conditioning was out at their house and the repair guy was going to come yesterday, but it was going to be sometime in the afternoon. And I work for my mom and the last thing my mom wanted was for my nephews to be sitting around in that really hot house because I think it was like 84 degrees inside the house. And so um, she had them come by the office yesterday to spend the day in the nice air conditioned, you know, office. And um, my nephews, they are three very energetic little boys. The oldest one is six, the middle one is four. And the baby, he just turned three. We actually had a birthday party for him on Wednesday. And so um, they came by the office yesterday and they were just, you know, so like, you know, energetic. And I had like such a, an amazing time playing with them and chasing after them that when I got home, I was pretty tired and I didn't really have many steps um, under my belt. And so what I decided to do was I was going to meditate and then take a little bit of a nap. And then I, after I get up from my nap, I would, you know, start working on my steps and I actually fell asleep in the middle of my meditation and I didn't get up until first thing this morning. And so I didn't get my steps in. And so I broke my streak. For my steps, I had like a 15 day streak getting them in. And then for calinetics, I'm not sure what the streak was because I think on the third day, I didn't do calinetics on the third day of June. And so I had to restart my uh, streak for that. And so, um, 
it's always definitely disappointing to break a streak and usually when I do break a streak I kind of like let that be like the door for me to open to me not doing what it is that I've been trying to accomplish and so um, the last time I had like a nice walking streak going I think it was in the month of March and then I kind of like fell off the wagon and didn't start getting my steps back in until late May and so um, Anyways, I decided that that's something that I don't want to do anymore. So when I got up this morning, I decided to pick myself up and, you know, start right then and there. And so that's why my video for today is a little bit late because I've been outside walking for a little bit so that I can, you know, get some steps in. And that's something that I'm, you know, that's becoming important to me because I feel so good after, you know, walking. But um, I just want to encourage you that if, for whatever reason you like um, fall off the wagon of some sorts of whatever it is that you're doing whether it's you know exercise or if you like end your fast a little bit early or if you have something that you shouldn't be eating just you know pick yourself up and start fresh right then and there and so um, there is no use dwelling over what happened in the past you can't like change that um, and all it will do is probably make you feel a little disappointed. And so just kind of like pick yourself up and just start right then and there. And so that's what I had to do today. And so I've got a new streak going. Um, this is going to be day number one and I already have around like 6,000 steps under my belt. So I don't really have that much to do. Um, and I still have most of the day ahead of me. And so, um, that's what I'm going to do is just, you know, pretend yesterday just didn't even happen. And you know what? Sometimes your body just um, needs rest. And so it was probably better for me in the long run to get that sleep. And so I'm refreshed today and I'm good to go. And I just wanted to kind of like share that with you to pick yourself up and, you know, keep going. So I hope that you have an absolutely amazing Friday and that you have like an amazing start to your weekend and I will check back in with you tomorrow. Take care. Bye.